Thank you for hanging out with me today. This is KJ48, and welcome back to Grounded. So today we are going to be going out and looking for feathers again. We're going to be looking for molars, feathers. We're going to be doing quests. We're going to be doing exploration and building up of my character, getting ready for the Haze Lab. I really want to do the Haze Lab, but I don't want to go in the Haze Lab and bang my head against the wall and die like 50 times. That's just, that would not be fun for me, like at all. And I'm not as powerful as I could be. Uh, getting more molars will allow me to unlock more things. I actually have enough uh, molars for some stuff right now. Let's take a look really quickly. All right, so I actually have some molars here. I'm gonna, actually I don't have enough regular molars because I'm going for active mutations all the way up before I do anything else. Uh, so I don't have enough for that, okay? But the group uh, one for milk molars, hell yeah, dude. I got, I could either get max consumable size and max arrow size, or I could get max resource size, or I could just get maybe max consumable size and then get max resource size later, I don't know. Um, I did put this up for a vote on my channel, though, so go check that out and uh, vote whatever you guys think. Because I'm kind of torn, so I don't really care which way I go with it. Um, so I'm interested to see what you guys have to say about it. Uh, one other thing I want to talk about before I go to sleep. I put up lights in this place. You see that, like, that, like, I don't even know what to call it. That, like, it looks like someone smeared Vaseline on my monitor. You see that, like, that, that effect from the light that's kind of, like, blurry a little bit I, I i don't know how to explain it it looks like shit i really wish i could turn it off i actually went into all my settings i could not find a way to turn that that light you know effect off it, it just really makes the game look bad like right there look at that look at that like it's just i hate it <laughs> i really hate it and i wish i could turn it off i guess it's not so bad in first person it's more when you're in third person because you actually really get close to the can to the canvas but i like to play in third person anyway that's neither here nor there. Let's get some sleep. And what am I going to wake up? 7 o'clock in the morning. Sounds pretty good to me. Sounds pretty good to me. We're going to be doing some exploration. We're going to stay out of the high part of the uh, of, of the yard because I can't even use the resources I get there yet anyway. Uh, and we're just going to go around. I really want to find some feathers, guys. Um, some people are telling me they have a theory that I have blocked the crow from getting over here, which would really, really suck. I have not seen the crow here in weeks. Like... Maybe a couple weeks, like, in real life. Uh, it kind of feels like that. Maybe I'm wrong about that. I don't know, but it really it really blows to where I want to build. I have to block the crow, but whatever. Um, there's other places to get uh, the feathers. So I do have a map of where to get milk molars. So what I think I'm going to do now is, um, you know, I'm probably going to need food. I don't think I have a ton of food. Let's check out the food chest. Oh, there's no food in there. Um, we do have some of this... Uh, that jerky stuff but this stuff is gonna go quick you know but whatever i might as well use it all right let me get some food drink healing all that good stuff and then we're gonna go out and look for molars and feathers oh i love these zip lines they're so freaking dope i am going to go hit up the old anthill there's supposed to be a molar in there pretty sure i've never been in there and that's also going to take me down south so i could check out uh that crow area on the t on the north laser you know and um yeah I brought my ant suit with me, so I, I don't get attacked by ants. And, uh, yeah, it should be relatively easy to roll on roll on in there and roll out with what I need. But you never don't can tell in this game, it. right? Never can tell. You know what sucks about the crow feathers? Once I find one, a lot of people have been telling me, Oh, Cage, okay, just, you know, uh, put the crow feathers on the scanning thing, and then you'll know where they are. No, you need you need to find one first. You can't You can't just scan stuff until you've found the item first. So once I find one crow feather, it should be, you know, hopefully painless after that. But <laughs> I'm not convinced. We'll have to see. All right. Let's see what we got down here. <clears throat> All right. We have to keep a lookout for the rare resources as ant well. Spotted. Yes, you have spotted an ant, my friend. Should probably pick up the rocks as well, to be honest. But oh, hold on. Nope, that's a pebble, and that's a pebble. Okay. Oh, that's a good one. Yep. Uh, pebble. Uh, oh, brittle stone, brittle marble, brittle marble shard. Kind of look around up here. Nothing. Nothing. A little crack up there. That's pretty cool. I do appreciate the light. All right, more pebbles. I gotta make some more torches too. Uh, yes. Well, what about that one? 
Eh, nope, just a pebble. Damn it! Damn it, Bobby! That don't look like a pebble. That looks like one of the rare ones. Hey, we're good. We're good. We're friends. Oh, we got a scarab down here. Do those do anything for me, or are they just like lore? I think they're just lore. Oh, okay, cool. Let's break into this sucker. We will get back to the ant hill in one second. I finally found one. It is way up there. Oh boy. Okay. Um, I did not see. I'm kind of by the north laser, and I did not see the um, crow on the laser, but I did hear him, and when I looked up, I saw him flying by. So this is fantastic. Yeah, I'm kind of full on stuff. That's okay. I will not be full on stuff for long. Let's grab this thing. Damn, that's freaking ginormous, man. I didn't know it would be that big. A lot of people told me it would be on top of the grass, so thank you for that. <laughs> Make sure I look up there. Let's go ahead and eat this. Consume. I will consume you. You come over here, spiders, and you're going to rue the day. All right? You're going to rue the day. So let's go ahead and chop these all down and get that bad boy. Oh, I'm so freaking happy. Actually, will it come down? I've had I've had stuff, like, up in grass before. Not crow feathers, obviously, but I've had other things up in grass that don't fall sometimes. Like water and aphids and stuff. But this thing looks like it's going to fall, so that's fan-freaking-tastic. Can't see anything. There we go. All right. Oh, God, I'm getting buried under my own grass. All right, let's go ahead and chop this one. Oh, it's exquisite. Hell yeah! Come to me. Come to me, feathers. Okay, what is that, four? Five? Is that normal to get, like, five? Is that about right? There's no more, like, lying around that I can't see. There we go. Yeah, I'm not really seeing any more. Throw these over here. I feel like they would be visible here. Okay, great. So, let's go to the... Um, let's go to our uh, mystery machine base. Oh, I really want to be able to, like, label my markers. Is Please tell me there's a way. Like, I can't believe you can't label your markers. All right, let's go here, and then we're going to go... Where is it? It's down here. And we're going to study this thing. We're going to study these. Is five enough? I don't remember how many, I need, how many I need. I don't think five's enough, but the thing is I could track more down. So, yeah, that was awesome was awesome. Okay, uh, there we go. Pro feathers. Analyze. Simple bed. No. Marksman's cap. Mm, don't think so. Crossbow. Oh, are feather arrows needed for the crossbow? Am I going to need feathers for arrows? I did not think about that. Um, let's take a look. All right. So the crossbow. Um, all right. So I'm going to need six. Acorn shells, that stuff's not a problem. Uh, a crossbow made out of crow feathers. So, I'm thinking I don't need feather. Uh, a fancy arrow crafted from sleek crow feather bits and stranded rope. So, I'm thinking these are just stronger and you don't need them. Uh, so, let's take a look at the arrow. Is that really that much better? I mean, it is. Well, what else do I need crow feathers for? Like, once I get the once I get the crossbow, I'm I'm assuming you use crow, crow feathers to fix it. But maybe not. You might actually use silk rope to fix it, just like the other bow. So what else would I need feathers for? I might as well use it for arrows, right? All right, so let's talk about the anthill. Um, first of all, before we talk about the anthill, what is with these sturdy marble shards? Because those aren't the regular marble shards. So better than normal ones. Yeah, you got that right. All right, cool. Um, as far as the anthill goes, um, I'm glad I went in there because I got some good resources. That is not where the molar is. The molar's in the ant hill where, that you have to get in through the through the lab. Now the, there's like broken glass in the in the oak lab, and you can get into the ant hill from there. I've done that, but did I get the tooth? Because I don't remember getting the tooth, which really sucks. I'm not gonna bring you guys through that because you're gonna tell me, Cage, you got the tooth in episode blah blah blah, and I'm like, I don't remember. So I'm gonna go in there. If I don't find the tooth, I'm gonna assume I already got it. And if I do find the tooth, then I'll show you. <laughs> I just, I hate not remembering. And I didn't name the episode like, oh, I found a tooth in the anthill. Like, so I wouldn't even know what episode to go look at for it. Now, before I go back into the ant, the old ant hill through the, uh, the lab, the, what is it called? The oak lab. Um, I do see some feathers over here, so I'm going to go check them out. They look like they're kind of in a dangerous spot, but I think it'll be okay. Um, I definitely need at least one more feather to get, you know, uh, the crossbow. And I think I'm... 
I think I'm just gonna upgrade the crossbow and go with it and just say to hell with it. Hopefully, I'm hopefully it's the right decision. A lot. Some people say the insect bow is better because it's faster. Some people say the crossbow is better because it does more damage. So it's like whatever. I guess it's just how you want to play the game. I'm gonna go with the crossbow. Hey, All right. So where is that feather? It's over here somewhere. Over here is the feather. Can't hide from me now, feathers. Just believe that. Um, okay, so it should be right around here somewhere. It is really close to the to the bad spots. Also, um, as far as the haze goes, I'm gonna stop using the gas mask and start using the and keep using the toxicology badge for added defense. Oh, is it actually in the haze? I think it might be in the haze. Son of a b. It's in the haze. I don't think I'm going. Yeah, I'm not seeing it anywhere. But yeah, I think it's in the haze. Um, I'm not going in there. That's a death trap in that little area. Uh, not to mention the fact that there's also one over here. So what I'm going to do is I also got to I got to stop by this picnic table or not. Sorry, it's not a picnic table. It's a board. It's just like a plank. We're going to stop by the plank and there should be a tooth over there, I believe. Um, although there is, uh, it, I think it's in a um, a wolf spider den. So I don't know. I, I might <laughs> I might just skip that one for now. Uh, we'll see, but you know, I'm, I'm definitely gonna go over there and um, that plank I have to I have a quest to make a marker at plank cliff So I should probably gather what I need for the marker before I go there because I don't know how dangerous it's gonna be So let me do that now. Okay, so there's a half-eaten hot dog over here Which is pretty comical um, And there's the board All right I'm not sure exactly where I'm supposed to make the uh make the um the marker though Let's take a look at the quest uh, status to see if it says anything. Quests, uh, Plank Cliff. Plank Cliff is one of many lost sites, legend, blah, blah, blah. Raise the bones, complete trail marker at Plank Cliff. All right. I will try this once on the plank. If I can't, if it doesn't work, I'm just going to go online and look for it. Because this is a large area, and I'm not sure exactly where this um, thing needs to go. So, I'm, I mean, I'm assuming it just goes right on top. So, let's come on up here. All right, and grab some water. Nice and clean. Because why not? I'm feeling a bit peckish. And let's do this. Yes, no, maybe so. Doesn't seem like it did anything. Nope, not the right spot. So you gotta, you gotta like find the right spot. All right, let me look it up. All right, it says keep heading up the left side, and there'll be a spot for the marker, so you don't have to guess. Oh, there it is. Oh, okay, cool. Oh, it's already made. I have to... Oh, okay. I don't make my own. I have the finished one that's already here. Well, that sucks. Can't I just... Maybe I'll just put mine on it. Maybe I could put mine on it. Nature's lollipops. Yeah, let me try. I doubt this is going to work, but... Okay, well, I, I don't even... Guys, I might have never done any... No, I've done one of these before, but we're talking like years ago. Like multiple years ago. I've been playing this game for a long time. Um... Yep. <laughs> Not going to work. Okay. Well, maybe if I take this one apart, I get most of the resources back. Let's see. There we go. Beautiful. All right. 100 raw, raw, raw science. Now let's go underneath and uh, see what's going on with that spider. This should be a lot of fun. Hopefully there's no spider under here. I know there's a milk molar under here. It's supposed to be like a, um, a wolf spider den. So... Um, yeah. A brave adventurer strode forth, approaching the mouth of the foreboding cave. This ain't, this ain't no time to screw around, bro. I'm pretty sure this is going to be the end of me. Um. Yeah, I feel like... Oh, boy. I feel like I'm in Shelob's lair. Alright, I see it, and it is sleeping. And there's some science behind it. But I'm not seeing the tooth. The tooth... Uh, is that the tooth right there? No, it's a spider sack. This is a bad idea. I was going to say right off the bat, this is a stupid idea. Oh, the tooth's right behind this. Hold on. No, it's not. The stupid spider thingies sacks look like teeth. What the hell is this? I don't know what this is. 
Where's the tooth? I don't know what that is. It doesn't seem like I can mine it. Do you think, um, spiders sound like this if you were, like, small like them? Like, do they actually, like, growl and snore and stuff? Alright, I don't know where the tooth is. Okay, I looked it up. It's right there. I don't know why I couldn't see that. Probably because I don't want to get any closer to that frickin' wolf spider. Um, here's the thing. I I'd like to just put away the... I'd like to just put away my torch and just do my thing here, but um, I'm afraid that you guys won't be able to see. So if I die, it's because of you guys. Oh boy, she's awake. Okay. Ow. Maybe I can lead her out of here and then come back. Maybe she won't. Is she going to come with me or I'm dying anyway? All right. Let's go ahead and do that. Oh boy. Eight. Can I... Live through this, or there we go. I did live through it. One long schnoz, There's no way I'm gonna be able to get down there and take care. I don't think I can do this with my current equipment. All right, I did save. I'm gonna try and suicide through this and see if I can get that milk molar. She's not gonna leave. I don't know if she leaves on her own or something, but I'm just gonna run in here. All right, hit this thing a few times. All right, and get the hell out. That should be a mega milk molar for what I have to go through. <laughs> okay. Um, I don't know if I'm going to have enough of these to heal out of this. We'll have to find out. I'm just going to keep running now. Uh, I'm not sure which way I want to run. Maybe I'll just get up on the wood. Eight. And eight. Okay. I lived through it. Cool. <laughs> that worked out, man. That worked out. I mean, maybe staying away from those things and using a bow on them is feasible, but stand there toe to toe. Uh, yeah, I know, Cage. Okay, just perfect block. I can't perfect block. I've tried. Can't do it. Sorry. But I'm going to take hits. <laughs> and I can't survive those hits. But who cares? We got it. That's awesome. So I came back to base and I kind of scouted out the Oak Lab old anthill area. And I'm going to need water stuff. So <laughs> that's what I got. I got a bunch of water stuff. I got a bunch of lanterns. Um, we're going to go ahead and equip that. And equip that, and I'm gonna use the bone trident as my weapon. Well, maybe you know what? Let's put that there just in case there's anything we have to fight, you know, with a regular weapon. All right, and I think we're ready to go. And I know I've never been down here because this this shit's deep. This this water stuff is really deep. I just wanted to I wanted to like go ahead of time and make sure it was somewhere I haven't been. It it is not anywhere I've been. So there's a hole down here. And let's go check it out. All right. Now, if, if there's something I can mine, it will always 100% show me the little mining icon, right? I think that's the case, hopefully. All right. And there's going to be some nasty spiders down here. All right. There you go. All right. I don't like dodging because then you guys can't see, so I won't do it. Give me the giblets. Give me your giblets. Six for healing. Five to bring that back out. I did get some oxygen for killing that guy, which is still weird to me, but, you know. Oh, look at this. All right, is there anything down here? Does it, oh, yep, there is. I might miss stuff down here because I'm not going to I'm not going to search as thoroughly as I normally do. And the reason for that is because I'm going to be panicking. I'm going to run out of oxygen. But we'll see. We'll see how it goes. All right, I'm not seeing anything else down here. Oh, take that. Okay. Hmm. Not seeing anywhere else to go or anything down here. I might be missing something though, so let's keep looking around. Yeah, I'm not. Can I go through here? Oh, here we go. Oh, what's that? Ooh, sturdy. Hell yeah, bro. Okay, let's keep going. Man, this place, this is long. Yeah, I guess you have to kill that spider. Well, you probably don't have to if you know where you're going. Alright. I'm going to skip that for now because I would really like to find some oxygen. We'll come back. We will come back. Alright. Give me my oxygen. Oxygen, bro. 
There you go. Thank you very much. And we'll leave the other one alive for more oxygen. And um, now we're going to come back and get this stuff. Now, I did bring my knife with me. Because I thought that there would be something like this down here. And I was like, when I was going up for stuff, I was like, let me bring my knife to you just in case. So, yeah. Actually, that's the milk molar. Okay, cool. So they're not all hit hidden in teeth. <laughs> awesome. And now let's keep looking around. Might be something else juicy down here I don't know about. Kill another spider for some oxygen. Okay, take that. Actually, I'm going to leave him alone for a minute. I'm going to kill him when I really need it. Right, nothing there. Ow. I don't know what that was. I just picked it up quick. Where the hell does this go? Uh, yeah, take that and that. That's a pebble. And where the hell are we? Oh, I don't like... Oh, are we in the koi pond? Yeah, we're in the koi pond. Oh, wow. That's crazy. So I got everything out of there, right? I don't even have to go back and kill the spider. Awesome. That worked out really well for me. <laughs> cool. Well, we could probably get out of here before the koi fish kills us. Let's get up here. <laughs> Make our way back home. All right, I'm just waiting for the sun to come up, and then I'm going to go try and get another feather. Uh, in the meantime, I think what we're going to do is we're going to make our second drying rack. Because I've been, I've been meaning to make this second drying rack for a long-ass freaking time. Um, I've also heard some... I heard a crow. I don't know. I didn't hear him land or anything. I just heard him crowing, so... I'm not sure what's up with that. I looked on the map, and I'm not seeing any more feathers, so... Just come up here. Let's go down in here. Let's make ourselves a second drying rack. Then we're going to eat, drink, and we're going to go out. Uh, now, I don't know where exactly this is it looks like it's just in some water i should be able to get that one i should be able to get that one and then i'll be able to make my crossbow okay here we go and we're gonna come down here and make the drying rack um i guess right here is a good spot for it all right there we go drying rack done now do i have anything to dry on it no not right now but that's okay, because we got it done. I'm also using this as a drop-off chest. So I'm going to um, grab all this stuff, because I'm going to bring it back to camp. And then I'm going to eat, drink, make merry, and then we're going to go out and uh, see if we can get ourselves um, one more crow. One more crow feather. I'm taking my shortcut through here, and I was thinking I might have to fight this spider. But I think I'm just going to run him off. Like, it might be quicker to do that. Unless he goes right to where I'm going. What a dick. Actually, I don't think I can run him off because he's got webs in there, doesn't he? Nope, I don't see any webs. All right, this is going to hurt me a little bit, but let's let's do this. We're looking for speed. I don't care if I take a little bit of damage. All right, guys, coming through. Excuse me. Oh, wow, I did not expect that. All right, fair enough. Get me out of here. I do not have all my weapons set up properly. Um, Bombardier! What's up, Bombardier? Bombardier number two! Two spiders and two bombardiers. Oh boy, it's getting spicy. <laughs> All right, I think running. I think running through was the best idea. Um, yeah. Okay, I'm gonna grab that. Might need. Might need to cook some food for where I'm going. I am heading down. Wait, no, I'm heading. Uh, east. Right, east. No, south. South. Actually, south and east. But yeah, I'm heading south. I've got a little. Um, I got a little uh, outpost down here. It's a little shack. It's nothing. Actually, it's nothing. It's just <laughs> it's a bed and it's a place to cook food. That's all I got down here. But that's all I need. I think I'm gonna walk out of here with a feather, which will be awesome. I should have. I shouldn't have that trident on me, but that's okay. No harm, no foul. That thing is really good at killing spiders. I, I did enjoy that. Uh, very nice. Very nice indeed. And we are almost there. Yeah, that's a much quicker way to go. And just run them off. The only thing is if there's spider webs in the way, it could be a problem. But, I don't know. Kind of messing around with it. See how it goes. Alright, so there's definitely a crow feather around here somewhere. And it is right in front of me. Hopefully it's not up there. It's up there. That's Oh, it's right there. Never mind, I'm looking right at it. This was definitely not here last time. I would have, saw, I would have seen this. Probably. Uh... One. 
Did I really just get one piece? Well, there's another crow feather, at least. All right, gotta get out of the water. Okay, one. Why am I only getting one now? I got like five last time. Now I'm only getting one. What's up with that? I mean, it's fine. That's all I need, but still, like, what the hell? Uh, is there more here? Let's take a look. Save the game since we already got what we need for the crossbow. Okay. Alright. Nope, I passed it. Yeah, I think it's I think it's um it's showing is still there, but it's not still there. You know what I mean? Like it just hasn't updated probably. That's what I'm thinking. So I'm not seeing anything else here. Alright. I think I'm just gonna go home now. I can't believe I only got two for two of them. But I mean it's enough. It's just I'm just I'm worried that I'm missing. Like, hey, Cage, there's more than right there. And it's like, well, it's the next day in real life, so. <laughs> I missed it. And, um, yeah. Well, what are you going to do? I don't think I missed anything, but it might well be the case. We'll see. Let me see if I could run home without stopping. <laughs> but that's, I, I'm going to have to stop to rest, but I mean running home through those spiders. How about running home without fighting? I'm, I'm playing pacifist mode. Got everything I need for this bad mamma jamma. Just need to grab some of these out of here. It's too far away from my crafting table. And there you go. Crossbow. Is it a... Oh, they're both here too. So, okay, fair enough. There we go. All right, I want to use this thing on something. Um, there is a ladybug out there. Let's go, uh, let's go shoot the ladybug a bit. What the hell? Did I just throw it away? Where did it go? It looked like I threw it away. I'm, I'm confused. What the hell just happened? I'm not really sure what that was. He just kind of smashed it on the ground and now it's not here. That was really weird, guys. I don't know what that was. I reloaded from an older save and I, ma and I, made, the, uh, I made the crossbow again and it seems to be okay now. That was really odd. I, I think he just threw it away. Just gone. He, just f he said, fuck this thing. And he just threw it on the Oh. Man, that looked like a... It was like a, um... What do you call it? Incoming attack. Um, I kind of want to attack a bee, but I want to attack them on their own. Um, there was a ladybug over here. I'd like to I'd like to try this thing out. Uh, maybe we can grab this one. Alright, this is what we're gonna do. I fought bees before, and they own me. But, I'm gonna try again. If I, ca if I can get one. By itself. I'm not really sure that... Uh, where's he going? Uh, he's flying. He's going fast. What a piece of shit. <laughs> it's like, come on, bro. I'm trying to get you. Okay. Alright, well, let's see if we can find that ladybug. I I, there was one over here earlier. But I had to reload the game, so I have no idea if it's still over here. I don't think it is. Oh, oh is that it? Okay, I see it. Alright, let's try this ladybug. This is just for testing purposes. Um, I did see her, didn't I? Sorry, big, big red butt. There you are. Okay. Doesn't seem to be doing a ton of damage, but... I, I am low on stamina. Mm, this doesn't seem very... <laughs> we gotta upgrade it. You going, chump? Now, the reason I'm testing this on a ladybug is because this is what I'm going to be fighting in the Haze lab. Although they will act differently. What? There you go. You got to shoot him in the legs, right? Get out of there. Man, this is running out of stamina with this thing. Ladybugs are weak in the legs, right? Okay. Excuse me. I need to grab some of my arrows. It's kind of weird they don't make you use bolts. No blocking, just running away. Alright, grab that. Grab those. Oh boy. Uh, oh, 
Oh, you dick! Seven! That's my stamina potion to you, by the way. Alright, you know, it seems pretty good. Um, I'm definitely gonna upgrade it. Uh, just gotta watch your stamina. It takes a lot of stamina. I'm gonna be honest with you guys, I don't think a crossbow should take that much stamina. Wait, is that another threat? Or is that the ladybug? Because I don't see the threat detection with the ladybug. See, there's no threat detection right now. So when I saw that threat detection came up, I thought it was something else. And you're done. Okay, I mean, you know, I think we're going to upgrade it. I think we're going to upgrade it. I'm going to upgrade it next episode, though, guys. All right, I'm going to call this one here, guys. If you, end up, if you ended up enjoying the video, and I know you did, make sure you uncage that like button. Also, if you're new here, please subscribe for more daily videos. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next time. And until then, take it easy.